Hello, this is Matthew Bauer of Acupuncture Now Foundation, and I'm really pleased to tell you about this course that I have developed called Healing with the Energy Equation. Now this course is somewhat unique from, from other courses that I teach in that uh, it is really the, the culmination of more than 20 years of seeing patients especially with autoimmune conditions, but not really just limited to autoimmune conditions, but patients who have a dynamic where they are literally burning more energy <clears throat> than they produce. And this causes what I like to call a chronic energy debt, where their body starts to burn more energy then it really has available to it and it starts to break down its own cells. Unfortunately it's not just breaking down fat cells, that would be uh, wonderful if it was, but it actually has to do with breaking down especially cells that uh, of the energy rich organs and glands and when that happens when you get a little breakdown here and a little breakdown there you see people with a wide range of different very difficult to diagnose conditions, whether they get diagnosed as autoimmune or not. Um, but this spans a very wide range. And this is a course where, uh, although acupuncture is a, a, a crucial part of the, the management of these patients, it's, it's casting the net as far and wide as possible, where we do everything we can to look at their energy dynamics, and I call this the energy equation. The main parts of the energy equation are simply this. We burn energy with every second we're alive, and so that's why we have to constantly replenish it from outside sources. And of course, the two main outside energy sources that we bring in is energy from the earth below us and energy from the sky above us. So that's yin and yang energy from outside us that is brought inside the body and it's the job of the internal organs and glands especially to process these two raw energy sources, break them down, refine them into a kind of energy that the body can use, then store and release that energy when and where necessary. And so you end up with a, a pretty straightforward number of parts of this equation. There's the energy intake there's how efficient the, re the refinery process is. There's how efficient, how efficient is the storage and releasing process and how the energy once released is transported where in, uh, it's necessary in the body. So you have these different pieces of this puzzle, uh, the last of which being the amount of energy you burn. If you burn more energy than you make, you end up borrowing from the body itself. But the good news is, if you can help your patients produce more energy than they burn, especially on a regular basis, your body will know how to bring back the cells that it has been devitalizing, breaking down to get to scavenge the energy they need for daily operations. So this course is about the whole enchilada. We look at every step of the energy intake from food and air, how efficiently the internal organs and glands are refining this energy, how efficiently it's storing and releasing the energy, and circulating that when and where needed, and then what is the energy demand that the patient puts on themselves. And what we'll learn is how to increase efficiencies in every single one of these different aspects of this whole energy dynamic, this energy equation. So this is, uh, you, you'll find elements of this which, which are similar to what others teach, but I don't believe anybody's put it together quite this way before. It's absolutely in line with uh, traditional Chinese medical theory. It's just being presented in a way that I hope you'll find very logical, easy to understand. And it also allows you to explain this to your patients. Because these patients, these patients that are suffering from chronic energy debt and the breakdown that happens to the, uh, to the vitality of the body, 
uh, over, over years of time, these patients take a long time to treat to try to pull them out of a deficit into a surplus and then allow that surplus to gradually bring them back to health. So this is one of the most important demographics of patients that you have to be on the same page. You have to be communicating well with this type of patient over an extended period of time for them to get the most benefit from this approach. So healing with the energy equation, all about not only autoimmune conditions, but many chronic degenerative types of hard to diagnose conditions. Uh, it's a very comprehensive course, and I think you'll find it very useful. Thank you for listening.